Well, back we go to the standard library's built-in functions, and I'm still taking a look at set. What I want to do is show you a quick and easy way of displaying all the methods available to you in a particular type of data. Now, you've already seen me do things like this, s2 equals curlies 1, 2, 3, close curlies, and then the type of s2 is class set. And then we can easily do a dir of s2 and get this. Okay, you say, we've done this already. Why are you showing it to me again? Well, then we took it to the next level and we said for each object in, well, do a dir of s2, colon, and print out each object. And everything looks very pretty. Well, there's another way of doing that. That way is called pretty print. To get pretty print to work, this is what you do. From pretty print, pprint, import, pprint. Oh, it'd be nice if I spelled from the right way. From pprint, import, pprint. There we go. Now, I'm going to pprint all the output from dir of s2. Let's see what we get now. Oh, the same parade of hits. Let's take a look at that. Update is the last one. All the way up to and. Now if we scroll forward a bit, we'll see the same thing in the previous list. Update and. And again, when we just did a DIR. Update and and. So once again, the syntax for that was from pprint, import, pprint. And pprint means pretty print. And then you can pprint, and then give me a directory of S2, and feed that to pprint, and you get this. Pretty cool feature, I thought.